This is me, Mr. Homeless, playing Minecraft using my brainwaves. For those of you who are new here, I don't upload, so it's useless to subscribe. But I have a good reason, and it's because I was creating a brain computer interface from this brainwave sensing toy, so I could use my brainwaves as a controller for Minecraft. It's insane. My brain has literal planets orbiting it right now with how big, big brain moves. Big brain. Before you dump on me in the comments section and tell me this is the fakest thing, my brain waves are now being detected. Let me explain. Okay, one, if, if you do think this is fake, you're the type of dude to use Cortana in Windows. Like, actually use Cortana. I lost the thread there. So your brain actually puts off different brain waves and different levels of those brain waves when you think about things. For instance, if I think really hard about PewDiePie, my brain might give off beta brain waves. But if I'm relaxed and building something in Minecraft, my brain might give off like theta brain waves. And this toy headset. <laughs> Luke, I am your father. Detects that and then makes this little ball move up and down for this toy okay. game. I'm not assembling this. But we are gonna wire into it with a wire and take the information that it uses to move the ball up and down and we're gonna send keystrokes instead of moving the ball. It's a real thing. I had to learn to write code. If I've done this properly, then I upload this code. I did it wrong. I wrote code and I'm just a bro. It's real science. It's been researched by like big colleges. Your brain puts off brain waves. There's like millions of dollars dumped into it. Insane, huge industry, prosthetic arms, all kinds of stuff. And so what we're gonna do is we're gonna take all that and play Minecraft with it. So this headset has an EEG chip, which is this little chip right here that has a solder on it. I did that solder. Who would have thought? Who would have thought? Not me. So it sends information out to this wire, which we then hook up to this computer, which is a Latte Panda Alpha, which is basically, it's a Windows computer that can run Minecraft, but also has a little pin to where we can connect our information from the headset to it. We're freaking nerds, bro. Gosh, I like being it. This is awesome, dude. We're gamers. This is what the information looks like whenever my computer receives it. The farthest left value is how well we're connected. The second number is our attention value, and the third number is our meditation value, which we'll be using to send keystrokes. Don't you dare tell me I was cool in high school. That's, a, that's an insult. This headset, the original one, doesn't actually work. And it's not, because I don't have a brain. Ugh, I can see you typing that down there. Because this is the new Star Wars version? I don't know. It's $40 Toys R Us. Riptar toys are up. We went and bought another headset from a different toy, and then we were able to get brainwave readings. We attach these to our ears. I'm a gamer. I'm a gamer. That data right there, that's our brainwave data. So basically, if I zone out, it lowers the meditation value, which can then be used to trigger a key press. And then if I concentrate really hard, the meditation value will go up, which can then also be used to trigger a key press, which involved writing code, which I did, bro. Oh my, it's typing W, hands free with my brainwaves. And then I fired up Minecraft, changed the control preset to mind control Minecraft, and then it was time to play Minecraft with my mind. Small dumpster. Yeah. Put my computer in there. I made sure to capture every single possible angle so none of you kids out there can say, hey, somebody's just standing behind you controlling it. No, we got all the angles so you can see there's no one around me anywhere in the room. <clears throat> Camera one, two, three. We're capturing screen, device, powering on, checking readings. If my meditation value goes low enough, we should start walking. I am going to attempt to zone out and control Minecraft with my mind. So as it turns out, when I have this many camera angles going and stuff, I focus a lot. It's very hard to zone out when I'm focusing this hard. So it was actually very difficult to zone out. I can't do it, I'm focused so hard on creating the video. But after like 10 minutes standing there, looking like Patrick Starr, uh... finally, it happened. And in the name of science, I had to repeat it immediately afterwards to confirm it was yes. a real thing. Yes! Yeah! Okay, okay. But now, then I had to focus hard enough to send the other keystroke. 
Massive concentration. I'm gonna have to focus it into existence. Mm. Five times five is 25 times 25 is 9,050, 4,060. This is like using the force. Yes, I did it, I did it. It hit 87 on the focus value and he freaking hit the block. Okay, okay, I, I'm game. And then after some practice, I was actually getting the hang of using my brainwaves. So now, yes. Moving forward, now we need to hit the wall. And I've watched the Mandalorian, Baby Yoda, face the Mandalorian, raise Baby Yoda, focus, hard focus. Yes, yes, yeah! I'm playing Minecraft with my brain waves. Yes! Yes. This was all done with a $30 chip that was made oh in 2009. God. I know it's not complete oh control, and it's obviously not yes. the easiest thing to use. Yes! Am I getting hit? I'm getting hit, I'm dying. No, but if a bro in an, an abandoned apartment is able to do this with a 10-year-old chip, I think the tech probably exists okay, to make a cheap mass-produced controller that functions okay. from our brainwaves. I just played Minecraft with my mom. I'm literally Iron Man right now. Also, maybe this is how they service ads on Instagram. They just read our brainwaves, dude. And I know what you're thinking. I am not going to hook it up to where when I concentrate really hard, it makes a fart sound. I'm just not gonna do it. I wanna give a quick shout out to a channel that I'm super hype about. My good friends make family-friendly content, family and children's content, k &L Family Time. I did a collaboration with them, so I'm going to be in their next video. I ask that you only go watch it if this is the style of content that you actually enjoy, like family and children's content. We don't wanna tell the algorithm that they have like a gaming channel. We just want to send people over there that might enjoy their actual content. So if that's something you enjoy, Here's a small preview of the video, and uh, thank you for watching. Have a good day. Crash right here, I'm not just gonna leave it. Can I help you? What are you doing? Well, I was throwing some trash away. Who are you? I'm Mr. Homeless, from, from my channel, basically homeless, I'm gaming.